It says you're feeling quite so healing. I just only came today very spontaneously. And definitely I would like to tell you the difference between the anger. Yeah, the, 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 the difference between the anger and difference between the fear. And you will be know uh, how to recognize this two low vibration energy, which one serving as our the best in our body, okay? So imagine fear and anger. They are completely two different low vibration. They are completely different low vibration, which is only giving you um, the opportunity to rise, uh, opportunity to rise and evolve. So I would like to give you the vibration around the fears is something starting at the beginning, wherever you feel in that fear, okay, it depends about your wounds, okay, it depends always about your wounds. So for example, if your wounds are around, I don't know, escaping something in your life, then you can start feeling from your legs, but that um, fear will be spreading whole um, I would just say I would so everywhere, everywhere in your whole body. So that would be the fears, okay? Or maybe the fears will be just um, going straight away from the head and everywhere, or maybe from arms to legs and etc. So that could be sorry, my cat is disturbing me a little bit here. So that would be the fears. So very short, very short, brief, um, very short and brief saying about the fears is. Fears is coming spontaneously from nowhere, but we know they have got a, um, a reason for that. They're coming and they're spreading everywhere on your body. And that gives you the fight flight mode and then they give you that paralyzed um, uh, state. And then you can, you, sometimes you couldn't move, sometimes you couldn't go anywhere. So that's the fears. The fears is giving you that foggy, giving you um, uncertain thinking inside you. So definitely, this is the fears, okay? Um, what else I would like to say around the fears? So if you start feeling the fears, count to five and say the word change. Because remember, that vibration inside you could be anchored or could be removed or could be transformed. It's your choice how you would like to do it. So I would suggest, not suggest you, I would like to say to you the, the way how you can do this is a transformation, is a transmuting your energy for the good, for the highest. So this is around the fears. Fear is spreading everywhere. So I give you that numbness, give you that flight fight mode, okay? And they are just only starting wherever your numb, uh, wherever your numb, wherever your wounds is, uh, from the past, from the future, for the present. But the anger, anger is begin in your heart because that's a rejection, that's a, somebody just only refused something from you. And that's all the stuff you didn't receive when you were a child. So definitely, definitely, you'll be start feeling the first vibration inside your heart. So when you put your hands on your heart and say, I'm lovable, um, actually, you are lovable, you are beautiful, you are great, you're doing fantastic. So keep saying in the second person to your subconscious mind because then your subconscious mind will be listening to you much more easier and better and that will be going to deeper and deeper level. So keep saying to your mind, you are lovable, you are great. So the anger will be disappearing very quickly and will be dismantling very quickly as well. So that's why the anger, that's the emotions inside you. You really feel that you would like to hit somebody, you would like to grab something and throwing. Okay, if you've got that kind of opportunity, throwing the things outside, perfect. Take and throw the things, but please don't harm anyone around you. I've been doing that stuff a long time ago. When I had the anger inside me, I took some plates and I was just only throwing on the floor. But remember, we need to say thank you, thank you, the plates, thank you, wherever you are throwing, because everything is a conscious. So, yeah, if you would like to do that, just go ahead. But please make sure no one is around you so no one will be involved in that danger. I would like to say that danger. But another thing is how you can release your anger is a squatting, squatting. So arms back, arms up. I can show you the next video how you can do that. But if you keep carrying on, just only simple squatting, <clears throat> floating with your arms up, 
then the anger issue, I would like to say, will be disappearing very quickly. So please remind yourself, you are lovable, you are amazing, you're doing great, you are fantastic in the second person, okay? Because your subconscious mind will be listening to you very easy and very quickly. Yes, that's why I would like to say, and also the anger is coming from your childhood, definitely. Everything is from the childhood, I would like to say. By the way, everything and most of the stuff also is from our ancestral lineage. So if you would like to heal yourself, you've got lots of work to do, but I'm not going to say it's really, really overwhelming, because if you're going to take one step at the time, one step at the time, you won't be lost. You won't be lost because your faith, trust will be inside you, okay? So that's why I would like to give you this analogy. That's why I would like to give you this video. Anger and fear. So you'll be know because master your emotions and find your truth. It's all about that podcast, which I'm just only recording every time with the other souls. So I would like to give you as well so you'll be able to recognize that vibration inside you and you'll be know how to cope with that. But if you don't know how to cope, or maybe you're not recognizing inside you, please reach me out and I'm going to give you that um, different technique, how you can release much more easy and much more quicker. Today I gave you just only a few, so keep carry on and try your the best and definitely small step by step, step by step. So I'm summarizing at the end. The fear is everywhere, okay? They're spreading, they paralyze you and you've got a fog uh, in your brain and you couldn't see properly, fight flight mode. But definitely anger, it's coming from your heart. Anger, that's the resentment, that's the feeling you've got from your childhood. That's the feeling you've got from, um, maybe that could be in here as well. So remember, but anyway, the point is where this coming from and where is that began and also how is that feel so the anger is like a really clinging and really oh, that kind of emotion okay you need to release 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 that muscles okay and say you are lovable you are amazing you're doing great great keep squ squatting or you can punch the, ba uh, the back uh, if you are beautiful um boxer <laughs> i would like to say but if you're not you can punch too so keep carry on keep carry on and say the beautiful mantra you can meditate but what i generally said no suggest uh, what i would like to um, see um inside me sometimes if i feel that anger is coming definitely i'm going for walk i'm going for run because that energy needs to be released from your system that energy needs to be transmuted for the different uh, frequency so definitely keep moving keep moving when you're sitting it's going much more increasing the vibration is going to increasing 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 and then it's going to start overwhelming and then you're going to start um, feeling that frustration and then you're feeling worthless you're feeling helpless so that you just only going deeper and deeper and deeper you don't want to get up dress up and say i've got this you've got this and just go and do it something okay keep squatting you don't have to go anywhere. You have to just only get up from the sofa, get up from the chair and do a few squats and the anger will be disappear very quickly. But start believing in yourself. Start trusting in yourself. So all the best today, wherever you're on the planet Earth. And 4th of March 2023, that's my new course, How to Tap to Your Inner Ability. We're going to talk more about the chakra system in our body. And definitely you're going to meet me once and for the session. And private session and definitely you're going to have a lot of homework so please tap into that ability if you feel that really for you and definitely subscribe it my channel the youtube channel is a lot of stuff to watch and learn from it and if this video inspire you and give you some information and you're feeling uh, leave me some donation please leave me linking tree that's my um, link is over there donate and support my mission and thank you so much for being here with me thank you so much for watching and all the best i love you so much